November 4th, 2023, Saddler's Woods, Camden County, New Jersey. You can hear the sound of kids playing soccer. Lovely Saturday afternoon. And this very much feels like before times. Before what? I don't know. What a perfect Saturday. The kids having fun. Beautiful weather. Okay, someone's walking towards me. He's gone. I uh, always bring my video camera with me. Not so much to look at scenery, although <laughs> this is just too gorgeous to not record. But mostly looking for animals. And I have seen deer in these woods ducks every year for the past two years goats have been brought in to eat ivy which uh, <laughs> they don't they like the leaves well they do eat some ivy that's why we keep bringing them back I've lived in this area of New Jersey for 40 years and um, the reason goes back to the reasons we all have. It reminds me of my childhood. Around my sixth birthday we were living in Belfast with my grandmother and uh, I just What's always stuck to, stuck to me since that time it was a Sunday walk home from church with Andy Mapp with the leaves falling. Would have been October, November, December. And I just remember being just so happy to be with Andy Mapp. I later discovered that um, Auntie Mab had been the fiancé of my grandfather, my Irish grandfather. My Irish grandmother spent a mysterious two years in Nova Scotia. She hopped on a boat in 1903 when she was 21. Spent two years in Nova Scotia and the story was that she was a gym teacher in my cynical old age, I wonder if she was pregnant or if something, if something happened. But she was back in Ireland after two years with a lifelong desire to make buckwheat pancakes. I wonder if she was in Russia. Russia, they eat a lot of buckwheat in Russia. Anyway, I have uh, not found any evidence of her being in Nova Scotia, but I've got no reason to think that she wasn't, except complete lack of evidence. So Helen hopped back to Belfast and caught the eye of um, my grandfather. And uh, she married him instead of Auntie Matt. I just remember as a six-year-old thinking that I that Auntie Mab was so much nicer than my grandmother and I wish that she'd been my grandmother. It's 
so that's my story of uh, walking through the leaves, walking through the woods all these years later. I just love the fact that leaves don't give a damn. <laughs> They're whatever colour they want to be and they fall whenever they want to fall. Some of them hang on, some of them just drop right away. And they make this, this beautiful carpet for us. Okay, that'll be the end of it. I found uh, someone else is walking. I hope you enjoyed this.